Hi, I'm Dr. Brian Smith. I'm a chiropractic physician and a certified nutrition specialist. I'd like to demonstrate to you how I use kinesio tape to help the condition known as medial epicondylitis, more commonly known as golfer's elbow or even little leaguer's elbow. In this condition, the tendons on the inside of the elbow become inflamed due to strain or overuse. Pain is felt on the inside portion of the elbow and often radiates down the inside of the forearm and sometimes into the hand. The pain is made worse when gripping and squeezing or flexing the wrist and can range from slight pain to excruciating pain. Now the application that I'm about to show you can help golfer's elbow or little leaguer's elbow by relieving pressure, relaxing the associated muscles, and increasing circulation to the area. Okay, this is how we're going to tape for golfer's elbow, which is pain at the inside of the elbow. You're going to take your 5-inch strip, tear it in the middle, peel it back, you want to put it right over the point of pain, right in line with the upper arm at about an 80% stretch. Next piece, also another small piece, again right over the point of pain, but you're going perpendicular, making an X, going right with the line of the forearm. eighty percent stretch. Then you're going to use the long strip you're going to start about three inches below the elbow lay the end down with no stretch then you're going to come up fifty percent stretch and go along the line of the elbow and cross over. Again, a little friction rub, get it to stick, and that's how we do golfer's elbow. So that's how I might use kinesio tape to support someone with golfer's elbow or little leaguer's elbow. Now if you have bruising and swelling on the inside of the elbow, or if the elbow is unstable, it's very important that care is sought from a healthcare professional such as a chiropractic physician like myself, a medical doctor, or a physical therapist. Now, if you know someone who might benefit from this information, please like and share this video. If you want to make sure that you see our next video like this one, please like and follow our Facebook page. Now, if you have any questions at all, please leave them in the comments section below, and I'll try to answer them if I can. Thank you for watching.